social vouchers are very much a tool, for, first of all, of social inclusion and second for stimulating local economic development. The first social vouchers were launched 50 years ago with the birth of the meal vouchers. Social vouchers have been developed over the years in 41 countries to facilitate the implementation of social policies and meet the needs of employers, employees, as well as public authorities. Social vouchers are currently used by more than 80 million people every day. A social voucher is a benefit regulated by law that allows access to specific goods and or services, such as food and meal vouchers. And within this category, the user has the freedom to choose how to spend the voucher. Uh, they are not fungible, so they are very different from cash, from a cash allowance. Uh, they cannot be exchanged for, for, for cash, otherwise they, they lose their objective and their function. carry specific social and economic benefits. For instance, stimulating job creation in the local economy, reducing undeclared informal work and recoup taxes, promoting freedom of choice while nudging consumers' behavior, increasing employees' purchasing power and well-being. In most countries, the social vouchers are exempt from health and social security contributions and income taxes. In the case of food and meal vouchers, the tax exemption is intended to encourage employers to give, to give their employees access to healthy meals and better con working conditions and to have direct impact on local economies. Social vouchers have also proven to be very effective since the beginning of the pandemic, as they prompt spending on the most hardly hit sectors. In April 2020, the European Commission also recognised the relevance of vouchers by adding the possibility for EU governments to distribute EU funds with social vouchers. I think that this idea of meal or social voucher is a good idea and will ensure more uh, social stability and cohesion. Because e even behind social order, there is solidarity and there is social cohesion. Uh, in Europe, we have the welfare state that has been built up after the war, and uh, the, the meal or social vouchers will be there to reinforce or to sustain the welfare state. Social vouchers have been flourishing all over the world for the past years, but unevenly. What we have seen as a trend is that there is an extensive or an increasing use of vouchers in different types of sectors. In 2018, the restaurants of the plus de 4 million salariés bénéficiaires for 140 000 entreprises and collectivities clients, with a réseau of 180 000 commerce concerned. Of course, you have challenges. The challenges being that in the current crisis, the, the need to go digital has been highlighted not only for voucher for many for many social benefits in some countries self-employed people are not covered by vouchers uh, in, in, in other countries only public servants are covered by vouchers and not private sector people so uh, it's still a, a story to build uh, a story to tell and uh, to think of 